Hello, boys and girls out there in computer land. Um, and you might be at school land, but I know today when I'm reading this video, we are teaching from the table at home because we had a code one day. Um, so we're going to read a story in our book. It's going to have the seasons in it. It's called Seasons. I'll let y'all look at it. Now, what do you think that, what type of story do you think that's going to be? Fiction fake or non-fiction not fake? It's got a real picture with this little girl and she's running. It looks like she has a bird land on her hand or something like that. So, this story is going to be called Informational Text. It's going to teach us information about what do you think it's going to teach us information about? What? Seasons. Look at that title, how big and bold and colorful it is. It just boop, pops out on the page. And this is written by Pat Cummings. And um, she just took pictures because a lot of times informational text will just have photographs in them or photos. Pat Cummings loves getting letters from kids who have read her books. Sometimes they send her other things too, such as t-shirts, mugs, drawings, and even science projects. Wow. Clean Your Room, Harvey Moon is just one of her many books. That sounds like an interesting title. I think that would make me want to um, look that just at the title. It's so interesting. I bet it would be funny. So I'm going to have to look up that one. Clean your room, Harvey May. Okay, so this is informational text. It's going to teach us information about a subject. And in this case, it's going to be seasons. And I'm trying to get my camera fixed here. Y'all know what I have. We'll get my camera right. Okay? And our first Heading is spring. In the spring, fresh winds blow. We plant new seeds and green buds grow. What kind of new are they talking about here? Talking about something that's never been used before. So, brand new seeds in the spring. I like spring, I'm not gonna lie. It's one of my favorites. Eggs hatch open, little chicks sing. The sun is out. It must be spring. Look at those little baby chicks with their mouths open. They want mama to feed them. Oh, there's a few. And look at these two cuties. The grass gets wet. Splish, splash, splish. When we step, we hear it squish. So in spring, we know that we plant things in spring. We know that mama birds often have their baby birds in spring. And what else do we get a lot of in spring? Rain. So all the things will grow. My favorite summer. I love it. Favorite. Look at that. They're outside. They're wearing cute little clothes. It's hot outside. They're blowing bubbles and having a good old time. So this heading is summer. Everything about this will be summer until we get to the next heading. Then summer is here and it gets hot. We are not in school. We play a lot. I like summer. <laughs> let's see what else happens in summer. Bugs, buzz and hum. The plants grow tall. Next to them, I look small. Well, she likes to put a lot of wor rhyming words in there. What do you think? Tall and small and look. Boy, those sunflowers are taller than that boy. Summer goes fast. And when it ends, we will go back to school with all of our friends. Rhyming words we had ends and Friends, look how happy they are. That's how happy we all were when you all got to come back to school. Here's our new heading. What's everything going to be about after this heading? You can look at pictures, figure it out. The leaves turn orange and yellow in the fall. Now, a lot of my friends' fall is their favorite 
and season because it doesn't get too hot, doesn't get too cold. And I think that's why they like it. And then they like all the colors of fall. I'm, I'm, I'll, fall's okay, but I like summer the most. I'm just going to be honest. I really do. In fall, the leaves are red, yellow, and brown. In a gust of wind, they will fall down. What are my rhyming words? Down and brown. And let me tell you, maybe one of the reasons I don't like falls because I've got a lot of trees and I've got a lot of leaves right down here on the ground I've got to take care of. A lot of them. Let's see what else goes on in fall. The leaves crunch as we jump and hop. It is such fun, we cannot stop. Oh, now these are cute. I do like to watch this. Animals get nuts and pack them away. They will have lots to eat on a cold day. So we have leaves falling. We have kids playing in leaves. And what's this little guy doing? He is out putting back some food. That's pretty smart. And that way he'll have it to eat when everything's covered in snow and he can't find it. <gasps> Some of you all, some people love this season the most because they love snow the most. I'm not one of those people, but that's my opinion. I like summer. Other people, their opinion is they like winter. And opinion is just how you feel about something. And most people's opinions are different. So this is winter, our new heading. So everything's going to be about what? Winter. When it is winter, cold winds blow. It is fun to sled on the soft snow. How many of y'all got a chance to do that this year? Right on sled. Oh, look. When it is cold, some animals rest. This animal has a nap in a nest. Rest. Nest, rhyming words. A hat on the shelf gives us a plan. We will put the hat on a big snowman. Who can tell me what kind of word snowman is? What kind of word is that? A compound word. Snow, man, snowman, compound word. Well, that's a big snowman. So now we have winter, spring, summer, fall. Winter, spring, summer, fall. Which is best? We like them all. And there's probably something you can find about each one that you like. Even if it's not your favorite, I'm sure you can find something that you like about it. I hope you guys like this story. Hope you learned some information from this informational text. See you soon. Bye.